How's it going, you sexy beats? My name is Orcor Chief, and welcome back to Resident Evil 2 The Remake. So, in this episode, in the episodes right after, we will be playing as Claire Redfield. Hell yeah! Claire Redfield. A different nightmare awaits Claire Redfield, who is unaware of just how drastically her very ordinary life is about to change. Let's get freaking started. Yeah, I'm almost there. You know me, I'll be fine. I'll be back as soon as I find Chris. Why does everyone think I'm gonna get in trouble? What the? they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Clear. Clear Redfield. Claire! Claire, are you okay? I'm all right. How about you? you? Can't stay here. It's not safe. Go on ahead. I'll meet you at the station! <sighs> Leon, I'm sure you beat me here. That's where we were at, as Leon. Oh my gosh, we got a revolver. What else do we got? Ooh, letter from best friend. Dear Claire, first of all, thanks for the letter. Now, if you'll let me get this one thing off my chest. I can't believe you're really gonna do it. I can't believe you're biking all the way to Raccoon City all by yourself. Just to see your brother? What the hell, girl? Oh my gosh, yes! <laughs> I know Chris means a lot to you, and yeah, you haven't been able to reach him for a month and all, but you're nuts. You know how many perverts and assholes are out there just waiting for a hot young college student to come along and take advantage of? It's not safe to travel alone. Uh, girl, do you know who this is? This is a, this is a Redfield. Alright, Redfields can handle themselves. Have you seen the movies? <laughs> I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> <laughs> but your but your mind's made up, isn't it? Fine. I get it. Just promise you'll call when you get to Raccoon City. Don't leave your bestest best friend hanging, okay? Wow. Love ya! Aww. P.S. Your brother may be THE Chris Redfield, and he may have taught you how to fight and use a gun like a banshee, but that doesn't make you invincible. So don't get cocky out there. Aww. Air the helicopter! Helicopter, helicopter! <laughs> Safe room. Are you gonna get up? I'll be right there. Okay. Fucking jumps over the railing.
Claire. It's so nice to see you. How are you doing? That helicopter just came out yeah. of nowhere. I'm in one piece. I'm guessing you don't have a key in one of those fancy pockets? Uh, unfortunately, no. Mm. But how are you doing? You know, just surviving. <sighs> That's good. Yeah. Any luck with your brother? No, not yet. Claire, don't lose hope. I'm sure we're gonna find him. Fucking hell! Damn it. You know what that means? Yeah. Dinner time. Oh, yeah! Claire, I think you should go. Don't worry about me, Leon. You take care of yourself. Bring it on, you undead bastards! Claire, you need to go. Now! Okay. Let's get through this. Both of us. What you selling? Damn, yeah, bitch. <laughs> A quick draw army. I fucking love, absolutely love old revolvers like this, man. Key RPD. Is this is where Leon gets his freaking gear from. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> All righty. What am I going to take first? I don't know if I need any ammo for this or not. Oh, I don't. Oh, okay. I thought I'd have health and okay. I thought it'd be like I don't know, something like Fallout where you if you want infinite ammo and you use a mod, you got to have some type of ammo in there, you know what I mean? Oh, hey. <laughs> Ugly, fat bastard. <laughs> Your literal brain is showing. How the hell are you not dead? Oh, no, fuck, you ain't just gonna be. What? All right, fuck is. <sighs> that go in and discard. Okay, yeah, he is. He is here. Go ahead, put you out of your misery. Oh, yeah. Can I even go through here? Nope. No smoking. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that rule is out the fucking window. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my fuck! Where the hell can I go? Without getting trapped. Probably the worst place to go to get trapped. I actually know the worst place. Okay, he's dead. Well, he wasn't dead before, he sure as hell is now. Dag, damn, damn, man, he came out of there quick. Forgot all about this door. There we go. Okay, be right back. Let's go through here real quick. I honestly just want to remove the chair. See, it's all I want to do. Not hard. Very simple. And here is another question. What else is over here? Could you calm the hell down? You as well. Oh yeah, we'll need a oh, actually, you know what? Do that. And do that. Aha. Uh -huh. Yep. Oh, yay. Now where or oh, where? There's another box. No clue. But here's what I do have a clue about. You know what? I want you to go out the good way. What the hell are you doing here? Can't see! Fuck! <laughs> nope, you're not dead. Goodness, I fucked up your face. <laughs> You are very ugly. Notebook with missing page. Yep. I'm pretty sure on the second playthrough they have different combinations. I might be wrong though. I think. No? Oh shit. It's not it's not Resident Evil 4, damn it. I just want you you have a very creepy face and I do not like it. Don't need that back. You asshole. You dead. Sure as hell is now. Sure as hell, sure as hell is, sure as hell are now. Or is it is or I don't fucking know. <laughs> Computer! <laughs> Great! Pet, he's not part of the rescue squad. Nope, not even close. And, uh, we're about to become his best fucking friend. <sighs> yeah! 
Yes! Love it! Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah. What was that? It's a liquor. It'll lick you to death. I don't think I'm ready. Uh, I don't think I'm ready for that. Do I have a choice? I don't know. <laughs> I don't think I do. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. Isn't that lion statue? It's right above the main statue. Right? Yeah, it is. What the hell am I doing? Is there a... I thought there was a zombie over here that was alive. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Hmm. That's wonderful. I guess we're going to the library. Can we even go through there? I'm pretty sure you gotta have a key for that, right? Right, yep. <sighs> well. Y'all ready to see Malakath early? Oh, you better be. Because <laughs> we better meet him. Anything, man. I have. Motherfucker, I will fuck you up like Arthur Morgan. I am so. I don't know what to do, man. Like, I have to get through there. I have to get through there. I can't get to the door that he's right next to. You know why? Because the door that he's right next to has to have a fucking clover key. Should I just risk it? Should I just. I'm gonna walk very slowly. Just very slowly. You don't want me. You don't want me. I have AIDS. I don't taste good. Now can I walk under him? Wow, what an ass. <laughs> Yeah, there ain't no fucking- I'm gonna have to fight him. I'm gonna have to fight him. Get your fucking Spider-Man wannabe ass off the damn wall! Go! Go that motherfucking fast! Oh, hell no, he f Bitch. Bitch! My fuck. Yeah, made you rethink life, huh? Zach? He did not kill him. He ain't doing anything, he's just... Yeah, learn that from Arthur Morgan. Don't fuck with me, I will shit myself. And I'll make you suffer for it. Yeah. Okay, 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 I'm sorry. Hmm. Oh, we already read this shit. Yeah. Okay. Man, my uh, heart is racing. <laughs> I don't like when they just jump out at you like that and you, when you least expect it. That's not too nice. I know exactly what you're for. For that... For that... Freaking bomb. There we go. So what do y'all think about Dead Island 2 so far? 
I'm going to be completely honest. I probably, I'm not, I'm not going to pre-order that game. Um, I've learned my lesson from pre-ordering Dying Light 2, although I did enjoy Dying Light 2. It was very broken, but like I said, I will not be pre-ordering that game. I hope it does good, though. I really do. And if it does end up being good, I will get it and I will play it. Like I said, I really hope it does good. I really, really, really like... Fuck that. No, I really love the gore in that game. I really do. It looks so damn cool. And I hope and I pray that it is indeed a very good game because it has... It's, it's fucking hell. How long has it been in development? It's been in development for a very long time. But it also went through development hell as well. Which, you know, if you don't know, can very much ruin the quality of a game. And if it ends up being as good as the developers are making, out, making it out to be, then it, it could very well be amongst... I'm not going to say is, I'm going to say amongst one of the best games of 2023. Cause there aren't very, there aren't very many good zombie games, man. People aren't making zombie games anymore. Zombie games are gone, feels like. Or at least almost gone. Only good zombie games that I know so far is, and have played, is The Last of Us, Days Gone, Dead Rising, 1 and 2. Played, I played 3, but I can't remember how I felt about it. There aren't very many. I mean, World War Z. World War Z was actually not that bad, from what I can remember. It just wasn't 100% for me. I played Dead Island, but I never progressed through the story of Dead Island. Never did. I didn't finish the game at all. I didn't finish the story whatsoever. I didn't, at the time, I didn't find it interesting at all. Although it was kind of fun. I just, I don't, I don't know. I don't know why I didn't feel like playing it. But Sam B was always, the, he was the only... The main dude I would always choose. Of course, I would see what the other characters were about, but Sambi is my all-time favorite. Because what I'm scared about with these new games, man, is just... In today's world, I'm going to say this, and I'm, I'm going to say it a lot. I hate politics being in games. I, I don't believe politics should be in games at all. It's stupid, and it divides a lot of freaking people. Video games shouldn't be... Shouldn't remind you of the real world. I mean, I mean to a certain extent. What I'm trying, what I'm trying to say is, is that video games, they are meant to, for us to escape the bullshit of reality. But yeah, that, that's what I'm mainly scared about about new games, man. It's just being nothing but politics or just trying to shove politics down your throat. I hate that shit. Games should be only about. <sighs> games should only appeal to gamers, and that's it. Not about to appeal people that don't even play the freaking game at all. And we'll never play the game. Bitch. I, I, why did that scare me? Like, I knew it was coming. <laughs> oh. You come back to life, I swear I will cry. Okay. Jesus, stay back! Does he come in here? Does he come in here? I forgot. No, he doesn't. Okay. Ooh. I'm safe in here, bitch! Asshole. Oh, Leon's memo. Claire, I hope you get this. Whoops. <laughs> this place is crawling with monsters, and your brother's not here. Just get out of here as soon as you can. I really hope you're safe. Leon. Baby, don't you worry about me. I'ma get you out of here. I love you too much, Leon. You ain't fighting this shit alone. Wait, can I just go ahead and come on? Yes, I can. Awesome. Are you the same note? Yep, okay. What the fuck was that? Shit. Alright, gonna take you. What the hell are you? 
Two people holding hands, a balancing scale, and... Yes. Oh. No, not yes. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, just gonna keep you right there for right now. Nope, I hear him. I hear him. I hear him. Turn around, open the damn door. That motherfucker climbing. Now, what the hell was I doing? Oh, yeah, that's right. I have enough. I have enough. So I'm just going to put those up. Keep that. Yeah. Yep. For right now. Okay. <laughs> Motherfucker. You sounded like you was laughing. I don't like it. Stay right there. I want to see what the hell you are. If you are nothing useful, I am going to be... I'm not going to be angry. I'm just going to be flat out disappointed. Oh, you know what? You're going to be useful. Let me go. See you, bitch. Okay. Do this. Use. Crown. Fire. Bird. Awesome. Yeah, Dead Island 2 comes out April 21st. That's not long. Where the hell am I going? Where the, where the hell? Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh. I just realized I'm going to have to go... Oh, wait a second. I won't even be able to get out of the library. I just realized that. Because I got to have a key. If I don't have a key, I am... Okay, that was just everything settling. Every damn time. Oh, this guy. Ram, that thing, and then a bird. Oh, hell. Oh. Doesn't exist. Only in your head. Only exists in your head. That's it. Unless it was a... Unless it was the zombie, and that's it. What the hell is a bird? There's the bird. Bird is the word. It is. Someday you're going to evolve into a damn liquor, and it's going to be horrifying. I'm always preparing for the worst. It hasn't come yet. Okay, I expected something bad to happen as soon as I said that. Lucky me. Wait, do you... Are you fucking kidding me? Damn it. Okay. Whoa! Oh wait, never mind. Shit. Oh, 
Okay. Fuck you! He didn't like that! You are gonna be patient. Crown, fight. I don't even have the damn space. Where the fuck you come from? So lucky those won't explode. You know what? Crown. Fire. What the fuck was the other one? Was it... This thing? Yes, it was. Everything is A-OK. -okay. It's A-OK. -okay. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Uh, I saw him and I just completely lost track of what the hell I'm supposed to do. Mm, okay. Just wait. Just wait. <laughs> just, just wait. Um, I don't know where I'm going next. I really don't. Like, I want to go through there, but at the same time, I want to I wanna grab that book. Oh, wait. I don't have that other hand, though. That's the thing. Where is that? It's through here. What is through there for me? Do I want to find out? I kind of do. Let's go. Ooh, wait. I forgot. There is a safe in here. What the hell do you even go to? JM, what the hell is that? Oh, is that that machine gun? Because I know damn well it ain't that thing. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Open this damn door. Go through here, I said. It'll be fun. Wait a second. I was about to say, I was about to say, where the hell's my knife at? Oh, my. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna grab that book real quick. All right, I'm gonna grab it. What the fuck are you doing here? I wanna do this first. Let me go ahead and unlock this. Okay, you're no longer needed. Fuck off! Bitch, what's that? Did you really just catch up with me? Did you really just catch up with me? Yep, enjoy your snack. Oh, hell no. Go somewhere! I hope that damn thing falls. You big overgrown trench coat wearing son of a bitch. Oh my. Oh, bitch! I'm gonna eat this back! Get away from me! What the, happened? what the hell happened to your arm? Didn't you have an arm? Where the hell am I even going, man? 
Where the hell was I even going? Was it? It was through there. It's through here. Oh, good. Good. Students taking equal rights, equal fights to a whole new level. Is that? Okay. And that box was in the men's locker room. Yep. Yep. Move it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hell, if I can speak. Whoa, hmm. I am baffled. <laughs> oh, wrong way. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hold on. sound like Chris. made things easy for me, but you didn't. Oh, it only takes up one slot. GM79. This grenade launcher is capable of firing flame and acid rounds. RB, press RB to switch ammo type. Awesome. Cool. Sir, you are dripping. Oh my goodness, I forgot there's a th this was a safe area. Are you for the submachine gun? Yeah, you are. Oh, wait, I don't even need you anymore. You're done. You are useless. Okay, now I can just put you up. I mean, the funny thing is, I, I am never going to be using that little submachine gun at all. I'm going to be using this one because the MP5 is fucking awesome. And what would y'all do if Raccoon City was a real place, man? Would I go visit? Yeah, probably. Would I regret it? Yeah, probably. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Those weren't her he heavy footsteps. I almost said Hervey. Those weren't Hervey! Ooh. The same room as before. Oh, jolly. Jolly? Yeah. Well. Uh, won't budge. Oh. 
Hello? Hey. It's okay. I won't hurt you, I promise. Do you need help? Here, you can take my hand. I'm sorry, I can't understand you. You need help. Why? He's right behind you. What? Was that? He's got my unlimited. Please. Mm -hmm. That is mine. You cannot have it. You give it back right now. I told you. That did nothing. That did nothing. That just picked him off. That picked him off. Ah! I forgot how to game! Arthur Morgan Beach! Oh my gosh, he is on my ponytail! boy. <sighs> the hell's he doing?
It's safe now. It's over. Are you sure? Yeah, I promise. Everything's fine. I just need you to lower that ladder for me. Will you help me find my mom? Your mom is down here? I think so. I hope so. Yeah. Of course. I'll help you. Now my knife is gone. That big bastard took my knife. He took my knife. I love that knife. It never broke. <gasps> he dropped it. <laughs> Clay. This way. Come on, that shit fast as hell, didn't you? It won't move. Now it will. You got it. Hell yeah. Sherry, did you know you're gonna grow up to be a badass one day? <laughs> so, what's your mom like? She works at Umbrella. Medicine. Umbrella? That big pharmaceutical company? My mom's always at work. I don't get to see her much. Well, hopefully you'll get to see her again soon. So, where's your dad? He, um, worked with my mom, but he's gone. Wow. Both of my parents are gone. It's just me and my brother. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't be. It means we've got something in common, and that's a good thing, right? I now have more space. <sighs> to the basement. Or is it the garage? Basement? Gar same thing. Sure, this is the way. This is how my mom took me last time. Sherry, I've been looking everywhere for you, Sherry. Brave little girl, to leave your house in the middle of this mess. On the ground, hands behind your head. You can't be serious. On the ground now. <laughs> now do that five more times, <laughs> Sherry. Tie her hands. Why are you doing Shut this? up. Tie her. Okay then. You tie her up now or she dies. What's this all about? Child endangerment for starters. <laughs> Sherry. Come here. What are you gonna do to her? None of your fucking business. You hurt her, I swear to God, my brother is stars and I will fuck that! Ah! Damn! Get over here. What's your name? 
What's your fucking name? Claire! Sherry, you come with me now, or say goodbye to Claire. Okay, okay, I'll go! You better be taking me to my mom. Absolutely. Don't listen to him, he's full of shit. Stop hurting her, please! Don't tell me how to do my job. Stop! Let me go! Let me go! Obviously nobody taught you manners. We'll fix that. Oh, yes we will. Let me go! Let me go! I'll get you, you fucker! You creepy old fat bastard, I got you. Stay safe, Sherry. Okay. Key card first. And then that asshole gets what's coming to him. Now what seems to be the best approach here? Into darkness. <laughs> That's all we got. Well, we ain't going that way. <laughs> we almost found death itself. It's not giving me any other choice, is it? All right. Why'd you do that, man? Why? Now I gotta sit both. My this motherfucker just come right from behind me? What the? Okay, never mind. We're gonna test something now. We're gonna see if this is the only liquor here. You just do this real quick. And then just. Not that bad. We're a okay. Is it you? Don't you have something? Must be where that guy came from. Raccoon Monthly, June issue. Attention all Raccoon City heroes. Who's the most feared yet respected man in town? The answer should be obvious to any resident of our fair city. That's right, it's Police Chief Brian Irons. The man that scares the bejesus out of criminals everywhere and stern father that loves every last one of us sinful citizens. Chief Irons is known for his great charity work, including big contributions to the orphanage, support for abused women, art preservation, and animal conservation. Let us know if we miss anything. Just when does our great hero sleep? When asked, the city is my extended family. I'm just doing what I do for my family. Chief Irons, that's, that's not even his voice. <laughs> that's, a, that's a terrible. Uh, <laughs> Chief Irons said with a soft smile, look at that old creepy bastard. What the hell? That bastard is the police chief? Oh! Thank you. I love it. 
I can't go through the generator room, and I can't go through... What the hell is this? Express elevator to Chief's office. Not for general use. Oh, okay. It's just so small. You a whole bitch for that. You know that? You are a whole ass bitch for that. I saw him at the last second and I knew I was fucked uh, fuck to begin with. Daggum, I can't speak. Hello, baby. What the hell is you? Oh. Oh. Uh, can I borrow you real quick? Just, uh... Oh. You got a laser. Copy of, copy of emails to Chief Irons. Police Chief Irons, as thanks for your unwavering support, I have deposited a small sum into your account to use as you see fit. I hope I can count on you to maintain surveillance over your subordinates, especially the ones who survived that mansion. Get rid of them if you must. Police Chief Irons, I ran into some trouble with Umbrella Headquarters. The suits want to take the fruit of my research away, but don't worry, this will all blow over soon. You just keep doing what I tell you to, and everything will be all right. Police Chief Irons, you are up to the security around my lab. Your muscle heads are to shoot any suspicious person on sight. Doesn't matter if they kill them, or if they're Umbrella employees. I'm so close to completing G, and no asshole is going to get in my way. Police Chief Irons, get your shit together and do your fucking job. I told you, I need more security in the sewers. Don't you know how critical of a time this is for me? As for the money, I can pay you whatever once I take over. But not before. Why don't you get that? Never forget how expendable you are. William Birkin. Okay. <sighs> Mr. William Birkin, get me all sweaty. Won't you yell at me like that? <laughs> are you a book? You are a book. Ooh, taxidermy log. White-tailed deer, male, approximately six years old. Plates of capture are clay mountains. Length, six foot one. Weight, 353 pounds. Pleased with how it turned out, but I'm getting tired of working on these puny things. Maybe time to move on to more challenging animals. Man, he's a fucking creep. Siberian tiger, male, approximately four years old. Plates of capture, Khabarovsk cry. Length, nine foot six. Weight, 529 pounds. Goodness. I nearly can't... What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> it's actually meant that way. What the hell? 
<laughs> What's a lot better for you two? I nearly arrived when I, <laughs> I I nearly I nearly arrived when I sliced its yellow belly open and its warm guts spilled out. <coughs> wow, you are so fucked up. I still smell of wild beast. This is the life. Pig, female, 22 years old. Place of capture, Raccoon City. Length, five foot three, weight, 110 pounds. The specimen's body is soft, sweet, and white all over. And it's all mine, forever. Yeah, who looked at this guy and was like, yep, let's make him chief. <laughs> Thingy thing thing. Is there also a extra inventory in there? No, nope, I don't see any. Okay, that's fine. Whoa, what are you? Are oh, your masks? Uh. <gasps> um, I don't know if y'all could tell this, but uh, look at the key is just sticking out right there, and I don't know if it's supposed to be like that or if it's just clipping through. Pretty sure it's. Pretty sure it's not. <laughs> now I have two keys. Nothing can stop me. Not even Mr. Rex. Or even Mr. T. Imagine that Mr. X and Mr. T go at it. Who would win that fight? Mr. T all the way. Oh, hey! Are you the dead body from... That's awesome. Scared. Is he gonna smash through there? Let me out. Son of a bitch. I damn near God oh, damn near bolted in real life. Son of a bitch. Fucking that made me so damn lightheaded. Oh my gosh, he scared the living hell out of me. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Nope, okay. Didn't see you there. Go back to doing whatever it was you was doing. Heart. I 
think I just need one more. Yep, one more. Oh, it's not gonna break? Awesome! Need a little quick shower. If you're dealing with Birkin. Bacon, Birkin. Birkin, bacon. What the fuck? What the hell? Why are you screaming at me? Where the hell are you going? The motherfucker did a whole ass U turn and got got. Turning you this way so I can turn that off. Or turn it on. Keep you there. I'm good. Should be the same thing as Leon, right? Right? What the hell is that? Get juked, idiot. What the hell? Oh, I have you. Thank you. Uh, actually, yeah, yeah, I do, and I'm gonna, sh I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> now this is where it's gonna be fucking challenging. Do this. Claire kind of wishes she was like Leon in Resident Evil 4. You just jump down. All right. Now go around. Come on. I missed. It's okay. It was just a warning shot anyway. You're gonna watch me climb.
Wait a second. Are you fucking serious? I have passed the clock tower so many times. I for. I'm gonna let y'all know how angry I am at myself right now. <laughs> I, oh, fuck. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna grab you. Your same... Yeah, your same note. We did it! Thank God. The key card. Okay! There we go. <laughs> Hello? Good to see you again, Claire. We've got unfinished business. Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Stupid kid. If you just hadn't dropped that fucking thing, I could let you go. Don't worry, Sherry. It'll be all over soon. There has to be a way out of here. I break you or unzip you. Get you over here. There we go. Oh, yeah, motherfucker. I'm about to cut your eyebrows. Didn't you just, I don't know, rip that shit off? Well, I guess you are a kid, though, so I... Still has duct tape. What is this? Sally's Diary. January 4th. Wednesdays are perfectly great days, because we get snacks and ice cream. I hate the last place I was at. The teachers were all meanies. It was just study, 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 and, and there wasn't no ice cream. I love, love, love it here. Oh, don't you? January 10th. There was an important rule made today. Everyone must write a diary, get health checkups, and we ain't allowed outside by ourselves. It's good we don't have to go to school. I don't want to go and get picked on for my old clothes, especially not by the guy that used to wear them. January 16th. The orphanage director is coming today, so I'm going to wear my most favorite checkered blue outfit. The director is tall, the director has a mustache, the director is a policeman. The director is a fucking creep. <laughs> uh. 
don't run. I'm breaking the rules. I'm doing exactly that. I am running, motherfucker. Ain't nothing you can do to stop me. Wow, that thing is creepy. Darn it! I need the key. <gasps> oh no, it's him. <gasps> Pickaboo. <laughs> Whoever's diary. If you're reading this, go call go call police. Boogeyman's here eating everybody. Mini Bark Boogeyman's here. Help. They're coming. Help me, Mommy. Damn. I couldn't I couldn't imagine the perspective of a child during a zombie apocalypse type scenario, man. That'd be fucking horrible. You are pale as a ghost. Fucking creepy. I think that's actually the mayor's daughter. That's what makes it worse. Where you going, Sherry? Um. I told you to stay put. I told you to kiss my ass. You need to learn to listen. Leave me alone. Just please. Time to teach some manners. Uh, ah! Yeah, uh, bitch! You little bitch! You're gonna pay for this! Ah, oh, you little shit! You hear? You are gonna be so fucking sorry! Go away! Yeah, fuck you, you old creepy fat bastard! Let me alone! Help! Somebody, please! You stupid bitch, that's a dead end! Worse it's gonna be. Yeah, go on somewhere, Two Face. Yeah, you files behind there. Son of a bitch. No more. No more. Please. 
keys. This is your last fucking chance. Show yourself! Now! Oh, fuck! It burns! You don't, you fat bitch! Fuck you! I'm out this hole! I'm out this hole! I wonder if he was in control of that. Good to see you again, Claire. We've got unfinished business. What are you talking about? Don't waste my fucking time! Bring me the pendant, or Sherry dies. The pendant? What do you need it for? Do you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Is Sherry all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her... Are you serious? Damn it! Just you wait, asshole. Yeah! All right, this is a perfect little stopping port right here. Man, man, oh man, oh man. We got a lot of jump scares this episode. I don't know if y'all did, but I sure as hell did. That shit, man, hmm. I love this game. I love, I love horror games. Any game that can scare me is a damn good game to me, all right? If you can scare the fuck out of me, I will love it. <laughs> I mean, not right then and there. I'll be terrified as hell and try to get out of that damn situation as fast as I can. But you know what? I'll love it nonetheless right after it's done and over with and I get to laugh about it. <laughs> that we all can get to laugh, laugh about it. All right. Well, until next episode. So... Anyway, with that, I hope y'all enjoyed today's video, and I'll see you on the next one. And as always, my fellow orcs and orc kin, I hope y'all have a wonderful rest of your day.